The Military Working Dogs Unit at Naval Station Guantanamo Bay has a daily process. Some days it includes patrols, others it includes training, but every day it includes keeping base residents safe. A lot of times when we're out there, we're the, we're the front line security. Um, our job with, with the dog, one dog team can do the job for 10 people. So one, we can make the job a lot faster and go a lot smoother. The dog is going to find the, the bad guy or the contraband faster. We do have bomb dogs here. We also have drug dogs. Master at Arms second class Rico Loza works with one of these dogs, Keeley. Keeley is now a four-year-old Belgian Malinois, and he's kind of a mix between uh, clear signals training and a little bit of old school compulsion. But a lot of it just comes off of positive energy. With Keeley, he was a new breed, a new style of dog that I wasn't used to. So I had to pretty much force myself to learn this new style and force myself to, to tailor myself to him instead of you know being stuck in my old ways with the previous dogs. Their partnership is based on many things, primarily trust. What we're actually searching for and what this dog is trained for, I have to be able to trust him 100% and he has to be able to trust me. Keely has proven himself twice now and I can just let him go and he'll go and find whatever it is he's looking for. You know, look back at you, Dad, I found it. Yes. Absolutely. Trust me. Reporting from Guantanamo Bay, I'm Petty Officer Scott Pittman.